We're going to see a demo on the integration between the electronic signature of documents with VidSigner and Sage X3, both for documents generated within X3 and for external documents that need to be signed and stored in X3. In this first section, we'll see how we send an X3 native document to sign directly from Sage, how it is automatically signed by the issuer company, and how the external user receives it and signs it. In the second section, we'll be learning how to set up and use the configuration console within Sage X3, and how to send an external document to sign. For this demo, we will submit a purchase order. Within the Sage X3 purchasing menu, we will select our document and send it to print, we have set this document to generate a file, which automatically identifies that we are going to send a document to be signed electronically with VidSigner. We're going to use two types of signature, one that will use our company's digital certificate and a remote signature for the supplier. Our supplier will receive an email like this one with a document that needs to be signed. We can adapt this email's look and feel to our company's logo and brand colors. The signer will access the document and open the PDF with the purchase order. They can read the content to verify that it is correct and proceed to the signature. We can see that the PDF already includes the company's stamp. Here we can see the validated ID logo that can be replaced by your company logo. By clicking on the Sign button, they will receive a one-time SMS code on their mobile phone to verify their identity. Once they've done this, they will be able to sign. On our side, automatically, we'll receive the signed document on our Sages X3 platform. Here we have configured the document so that it will be displayed in Sage as an attachment to the purchase order. We open the PDF and see the Adobe Green Check that confirms the validity of the two digital certificates of the two signatures of the document. Additionally to the Send to VidSigner functionality, we can also find two main elements of this integration, the setup and the console. Within the setup, in this case for purchase orders and other documents, we'll have to configure for each document if we'd like to display the signed agreement as an attached file on Sage. We can also modify the label fields for the company and the facility, the keywords that will identify the order, and which types of signatures we'll need in the document. It is also possible to set where we want to display the signature graph, the number of reminders that we can send to one missing signer, and how many signers we're going to need. We're able to send up to 20 signers, for example. In case of having several companies, we can assign each one a different subscription with different logos and brand colors. We only need to do this setup once for each document. We also have the console, which is where we will see the status of all the sent to VidSigner documents. Here we can automatically see the state of each of them and manually attach any signed document or contract that we have to our client's file. It is also from this console that we can send to VidSigner a document that is external to X3. From the Add button, we just have to inform the object, the client code, and the type of signatures we need. After the signature process is finished, it will be attached to the defined object in X3. For a remote signature, for example, we'll indicate the language, the email, the mobile phone number where they will receive the SMS code. When we create the record, Sage will ask which document we'd like to send to be signed. If we upload a new one, this file will follow the same process as we have seen at the beginning of this video. We've just shared a demo on the integration between the electronic signature of documents with VidSigner and Sage X3. We have seen that we can send to VidSigner both documents generated by X3, and also external documents, and that both will get stored in the defined object in X3. Thank you very much for your attention, and see you soon!